So uh, the vision of uh, obviously uh, you know Citra Hub is uh, to establish a world class research organization for cyber security research uh, and it's part of the national mission on interdisciplinary cyber physical systems. It's a DST uh, run mission. So Citri Hub uh, basically aims to become uh, the place to go. Uh, for any kind of cybersecurity services, uh, uh, cybersecurity incubation, cybersecurity research, and of course uh, training. And we developed the India's first indigenous uh, test beds for uh, uh, power system, power generation, transmission, and distribution, water treatment, uh, industrial uh, uh, assembly line, uh, and various other robotics and, and stuff like that. Um, you know, uh, using AI and ML, we actually have our own uh, uh, malware analysis uh, framework in which you can have, uh, you can test whether your PDF file or your uh, Word or any kind of Office, Microsoft Office documents or your binary files for, you know, we can actually analyze uh, those uh, using machine learning techniques and, and, and actually do pretty accurate uh, uh, prediction. We have developed a crypto forensic tool which is now being used by a number of uh, law enforcement agencies and which recently got further funding from the uh, National Cyber Security Coordinator's Office. Uh, we, we try to do technology that is uh, required in the, uh, uh, you know, uh, you know to, for indigenous development of various uh, cyber security technologies, uh, tools for uh, fighting cyber crime or investigating cyber crime and so on. Um, so, so that's uh, what it is. Some of our uh, uh, students and employees have opened startups and we have uh, transferred uh, or licensed some of our technologies uh, to them. So some of these startups are doing very well like Prential for example, um, Triacle is another example uh, and there's a few others. Over the last five cohorts we have uh, I think incubated about 49 startups. And then I think uh, first three cohorts have already completed their two year incubation period and some of them have also been selected for seed funding. So we have also provided seed funding to I believe uh, four or five uh, um, uh, companies and, and I think a few other are under consideration. We use our institute, uh, institute incubator uh, SIIC. Uh, so they have their own uh, uh, process of uh, helping the uh, startup companies uh, you know in various ways uh, connecting them to various other funding opportunities and so we have been very uh, keyed into the Indian uh, response to cyber security threats and cyber crime threats uh, uh, so so we believe that uh, we are uh, kind of aligned with the cyber security strategy that the Indian uh, government as a whole is taking through its various arms so all the courses that we offer uh, of course, our undergraduate and graduate students get to uh, learn uh, various cybersecurity technology and 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 cybersecurity uh, methodologies for, for, from our courses. Uh, but but that is not enough, we believe. So we actually have created number of other uh, 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 you know uh, avenues through which uh, people can actually uh, get trained from. Uh, from uh, from um, Tritya Hub. So one of the thing is that we created an e-masters program in cybersecurity, which is a uh, fully online uh, 12 module cybersecurity ma master's degree offered by IIT Kanpur. And uh, right now uh, we are in the third third batch of those uh, uh, e-master students. So, so far, I believe that about 150 students have uh, been through the or, or going through uh, or have finished the e-masters program and uh, also we have uh, last year we actually created a very uh, long 45 hour long um, recorded online program uh, for undergraduate students that was offered uh, you know uh, via DST uh, program to almost 10,000 uh, students around the country. See, uh, cybersecurity challenges uh, for India are quite different from cybersecurity challenges uh, uh, in the world, uh, at, uh, depending on the on the readiness of the country. 
so in india for example the the uh, the banking and financial sector cyber security is pretty matured because of rbi and sebi etc on the other hand if you look at the other sectors uh, like for example power sector or, uh, or you know or or if you say look at transportation sector or if you look at the uh, government uh, sector etc we find that the cyber security is uh, is uh, not taken very seriously or they are just starting to realize that they can be targets for cyber attacks from from nation states and so on so therefore uh, we actually are working very hard with regulators and with various uh, uh ministries and so on to uh come up with uh, regulations policies etc with them uh, also the indigenous tools the development of indigenous tools is very important because we are so dependent on uh, foreign uh, tools like tools from uh, us and israel and and various other countries uh, which we actually need to uh, replace with indian tools of for cyber cyber protection so one important thing uh, this is october so uh, uh, cyber security awareness month so uh, we are doing various things but one of the important thing we are doing is an international conference uh, and uh, an invite only conference from uh, october 22nd to 25th uh, where we are having very uh, uh, you know experts in uh, four different areas post quantum cryptography Uh, uh, uh advanced persistent threats supply chain security and uh, also electronic warfare so we'll have uh, uh, you know various experts uh, from india and uh, other countries who will come to sitya hub and talk about these things and we want to produce some uh, white papers based on the deliberations at the conference so as to help the policy makers uh, to uh, at least get some inputs from from uh, us and and the other experts uh during that uh, conference we are also launching a hackathon so we have done several hackathons in the past uh, but this is uh, it's been a while that we have done a hackathon so uh, an uh, uh, will be launching a hackathon for cyber security related uh, uh, you know uh, product creation uh on the on the 23rd october on the first day of the conference so that's a uh, that's the other kind of thing that uh, you know sitya hub is uh, doing is to actually um helping uh, creation of uh, awareness uh, in the uh, you know other than training awareness is also very important the importance of cyber security uh, and various aspects of cyber security uh, that uh, we should right now care about uh people should know about that so, so that's what we are doing